Hey guys, what's up? Mike from the Premium Review. And as you can see here, Galaxy Nexus. Uh, also, if you saw my tweet, you also saw the moment I picked it up. Honestly, I walked out of the store and got my car and took a picture. So I've only had it for about less than an hour right now. So I'm really excited to do this, uh, do this unboxing so I can actually get into playing with it. I have not even opened the front yet. So, let's get right into this. In Canada here, this is the GSM version, 16 gigabytes, uh, pentaband 3G, and a quad band 2G. Um, it's a super AMOLED uh, 4.65 inch display running ice cream sandwich, so there's no buttons across the bottom. But I'm sure you guys have heard everything about this. So I'm just going to run through a couple more, and I don't want to bore you with uh, all the specs that you've already heard. Uh, running Wi-Fi A, B, G, and N, dual band, so the 2.4 and the 5, DLNA, uh, Wi-Fi hotspot, Bluetooth 3.0, 5 megapixel camera. Uh, it's running a Texas Instruments OMAP 4460, which is a dual core 1.2. Um, it also has accelerometer, gyroscope, proximity sensor, compass, and barometer. You know, all that good stuff. Barometer, I'm really excited to see what it is. But let's go around the box here first. So we got the phone profile. Nothing at the top here. Uh, there's actually, as you can see, it's shiny. There's actually a nice feel to it. All that good stuff. Google branded with Samsung, unlike the Verizon version. That actually has Verizon's logo on the back of it. This does not have a logo. And all the good stuff here. So, we'll t pop the top off here. Oh, isn't this killing you? It's off and you can't see the phone. There it is. Galaxy Nexus in hand. Let's pop this out. Feels really nice. Um, not 100% sure what the weight is on this. I don't quite remember offhand. But I'm going to say it's about 130 grams. 130, 140. I think it's 135. Thinking. So we're just going to put this beautiful beast off to the side here. And go through the rest of the box. So on this little flap right here, we got your uh, charger that comes with every Samsung device. Little power cube with a USB. Looks textured, kind of be. It looks kind of cool. Put that bottom right there. Uh, open this up. So we got quick start guide here. Uh, because it is the English, I mean, because it is the Canadian version, we have an English and a uh, French. We also have a set of headphones here. Uh, honestly, I never use headphones that come with phones. Not too particular on using them. I have other headphones that I like. So I'm also looking to get a set of Beats by Dre, but that'll be probably maybe a Christmas Boxing Day kind of thing. Uh, normal cable, USB. I think. Well, it's a, no, I think it's a USB 2.0 cable, but it's also the charging cable here with a micro, micro, mini, micro. S, uh, whatever it's called. Uh, what's it called? Uh, don't remember. And then the battery right here. This is a 3.7 volt battery that runs uh, 6.48 watt hours. So no kilowatt hours, no baby watt hours. But if you can see right there, this is the beauty part. Near field communication. So, we're just going to open this up here. While I open this up, I'm going to tell you about another recent discovery I have done. Okay, so I will start telling you about it since I just completely blanked. But, uh, in Canada, we do not have Google Music yet. But, thanks to some fortunate people and a little bit of tutorial. Well, not really a little bit of tutorial. Really none. Um, I was able to hook up, same as always, nice and thin and plasticky, um, I was able to hook up Google Music to my account. So, my Samsung Galaxy S2 that you guys have seen in almost every video that I do is running, has Google Music running on it. I'm having a little bit of a hard time putting this case back on. There we go. So we're just going to turn the boot up on. 
and we're gonna wash this bad boy boot up for the first time. So I'll just show you a quick thing on here. We're gonna go into applications, and as you can see, uh, Google Music. And I'm not sure what songs are on here right now. I don't want to get busted for any thing, but as you can see right here, Google Music up and running. Very, very nice to have. So, as we can see here, boot up screen we're on. Obviously, I have to enter all my information and stuff like that. So, this is the unboxing. And trust me, there will be a full review of... Oh, no SIM card found. Forgot to put my SIM card in. Anyways, this is the unboxing of the Samsung Galaxy Nexus. So be sure to check out the review of this beast of a ice cream sandwich phone. And like always... I'll catch you guys in my next video. Later, guys.